Hello world, this is Dennis, KD9LVR. Uh, forgive me uh, with it being kind of loud, the uh, the air conditioner unit is going, but uh, hopefully you can hear me for this part. Uh, I've made some changes with my antenna setup. Uh, I have moved my radio shack into the uh, basement to free up room in my bedroom. Uh, so I'm just going to give you an overview of what's going on. Uh, that one there, the coax with the green on it, uh, that's my inverted L that goes to over there. The coax with the blue on it, that goes out front to my, uh, my VHF, UHF antenna on the, uh, adjustable fiberglass, uh, mast. But, uh, anyhow, I'm still using those, uh, Comet window pass-throughs. I gotta weatherproof this uh, at a later date. Uh, as, as you can tell, it just rained. But um, this is where it goes in. And uh, let me pause the video and I'll show you where it is in the basement. Okay, so here we are on the inside. Uh, yes, this was done on a different day. I shot a video before on the inside here, but it was too dark. Um, the flash wasn't on, so hopefully this will work out better. But uh, here's where the coax comes inside the shack. On the other side, the, the window pane there, that's where the end of the uh, that comet window pass through is uh, attack is is and um, I have the coax you know running through the holes I drilled into the window frame here. Um, I got uh, cloth stuffed in the holes and I duct taped it, and I'll be doing more to seal that up at a later date. But uh, anywho. Uh, this is where the coax comes in to the uh, basement here, runs down on the floor here, and uh, go into the shack itself. Let's see, can you see it this time? Yep, yeah. oh, okay, better. You can see it this time. Okay, so I drilled holes through the wall here to run the coax through, but in hindsight, I should. Uh, drilled from the other side because that looks like crap <laughs> oh well <laughs> live and work, learn i can probably patch that up somehow but um the uh top one here is the coax for my inverted and the bottom there is for my vhf uhf antenna the uh coax for the uh, inverted l goes into my antenna switch here then obviously for the VHF UHF antenna goes to that radio there and um, since I'm doing it since I'm running the coax in through this way um, I um, I had to uh, weatherproof the connections outside so when there's storms I just unplug the coax run them in, on the floor and I stick the ends into this uh, glass jar here um, if anybody's got any suggestions on um, what I can do differently for that, uh, be very much appreciated. But uh, I'm hoping that you know would be enough. Um, might even get some lightning rusters in the in the future. Don't know yet. But uh, anyhow, uh, let me back up here and show you the shack. This is the radio desk. Um, this is all the radios I have on there. I'm um, still debating on that JRC NRD 535 uh, if I'm going to keep it or not. But uh, anywho, this is the setup. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. And as always, peace and all that good stuff.